Hey there, movie buffs and book lovers. Welcome back to Nana's Book Reviews. If you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon so you never miss a video. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of book to movie adaptations. We'll be discussing some of the best, the worst, and the ones that are just different but still worth watching. Let's get started. First up, we have one of the most beloved adaptations of all time, The Lord of the Rings Trilogy by J.R.R. Tolkien, directed by Peter Jackson. These films are a masterclass in bringing an epic fantasy world to life. The stunning visuals, incredible performances, and faithful yet creative adaptation of Tolkien's work make these movies a must watch. Even if you've read the books, the movies offer a unique and immersive experience. Next, let's talk about Harry Potter series by J.K. Rowling. This magical saga was brought to life by several directors over eight movies. While not every detail from the books made it to the screen, the films captured the essence of the story and its characters beautifully. The casting, special effects, and overall world building were top notch, making it a favorite among fans. On the darker side, we have Gone Girl by Gillian Flynn, directed by David Fincher. This psychological thriller is a gripping read and an equally intense movie. Flynn herself wrote the screenplay, which helped keep the adaptation true to the book. The movie's twists and turns, coupled with stellar performances by Rosamund Pike and Ben Affleck, make it a standout adaptation. Now let's discuss a controversial one, The Shining by Stephen King, directed by Stanley Kubrick. While the film is considered a horror classic, Stephen King famously disliked Kubrick's adaptation. The movie takes significant liberties with the plot and characters, creating a different kind of horror experience. It's a fascinating example of how an adaptation can diverge from its source material and still become iconic in its own right. For a more recent adaptation, check out Little Women by Louisa May Alcott, directed by Greta Gerwig. This 2019 adaptation breathes new life into the classic story with a non-linear narrative and a fresh take on the characters. The film stays true to the spirit of the book while offering a modern perspective, and the ensemble cast delivers powerful performances. Another excellent adaptation is The Fault in Our Stars by John Green, directed by Josh Boone. This emotional story about two teenagers with cancer was faithfully adapted, capturing the heart and humor of the book. Shailene Woodley and Ansel Elgort's chemistry brings Hazel and Gus's story to life, making it a tearjerker that resonates with both book readers and moviegoers. Let's not forget Pride and Prejudice by Jane Austen, directed by Joe Wright. The 2005 film adaptation starring Keira Knightley and Matthew McFadden is a visually stunning and well-acted rendition of Austen's classic novel. While some purists may prefer the 1995 BBC miniseries, this movie version captures the romance and wit of the original story beautifully. On the animated side, we have Coraline by Neil Gaiman, directed by Henry Selick. This stop-motion animation brings Gaiman's eerie and imaginative world to life. While the film adds some new elements to the story, it maintains the dark, whimsical tone of the book, making it a delightful watch for both kids and adults. Finally, we have The Hunger Games series by Suzanne Collins, directed by Gary Ross and Francis Lawrence. These dystopian novels were adapted into a thrilling film series that stayed true to the book's themes of survival, resistance, and sacrifice. Jennifer Lawrence's portrayal of Katniss Everdeen is iconic, and the movies successfully bring Panem to life. And there you have it, some of the best book-to-movie adaptations out there. Have you read any of these books or watched the movies? What did you think? Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe for more book and movie recommendations. Thanks for watching and happy reading and watching.